host Tamsil Asif and I welcome you all to my show Tears of Christians in Pakistan. Wishing you all a Merry Christmas. Hope you have celebrated a great Christmas with your family and friends. 2023 will be an unforgettable year for the Christians in Pakistan. How we spent 2023 only in misery and humiliation. This is not the first time that Christians faced persecution in Pakistan. Persecution of Christians has been recorded since the country's independence 1947. And the persecution taken many forms like discrimination, violence, rapes, forced marriages and bless me law. If I look back and remember, I have seen our Christian young daughter's honor has ruined and churches and houses burned. I have seen Christian young daughters, mothers and brothers went to the fields to hide for their honors. We all will never forget the tragedy of Jaramala Faisalabad. How our Christian community was targeted that time. How our churches were desecrated. How our pastors were targeted and attacked. How our pastors were arrested. We will never forget this. 2023 has given us very painful memories which we will never forget. The tragedy of Jadawala Faisalabad which was happened in August 2023 was declared as Black Day for the Christians in Pakistan. We all know that many pastors and organizations went there to help our Christian community. We know that houses are being built, churches are built, but the wounds the wounds will take time to heal. The Pakistani government has been criticized for its failure to protect the Christians in Pakistan and has been accused of turning a blind eye to the persecution of Christians. After this incident, we see in school, colleges and universities, our Christian students face a lot of difficulties. They were asked a lot of questions about their religion than their studies. And many children suffered from depression and didn't want to go to school, colleges or universities. And in the same way, we see in jobs that Christian has to face a lot of difficulties and persecution. Our Christian nation is left behind due to religious prejudice. Will our future generation will face what we have faced and we are facing right now? Our Christian religion teaches us faith, love, hope and peace. And I hope and pray that 2024 will be a year of peace and love for the Christian nation in Pakistan. I wish you all a peaceful and happy new year. God bless you all.